Hi, in this video for the Goodmans or Grundig FreeSat Standard Definition Receiver, we're going to basically show you how you can add and view non-FreeSat channels, okay? The official FreeSat boxes have a range of channels, maybe, you know, there could be, there's well over a hundred anyway, and these are preset, okay? So sometimes there may be a channel um, that you want to add that's not actually on the official FreeSat lineup, okay? And this is how you'll do it. Uh, traditionally in the past Sky News used to be on the actual FreeSat EPG but uh, I'm talking here in March 2013 and in the last few months it actually has gone on the FreeSat EPG and that would have been the one traditionally that people always wanted to add on to their system. So um, we can't do that anymore because it's actually on it but I'm just going to show you another one just as a demo of you know how you could do this. Okay, So to add an on FreeSat channel onto your box all you have to do is simply go into the menu Go down to settings, press OK, and just basically arrow down to the bottom. Add non-free SAT services. So you have to manually tune this particular one because it's non-free SAT. That's the advantage of free SAT, that things are automatically tuned in and updated for you. Uh, with a non-free SAT channel, you have to manually tune it. So I'm just going to press OK to manually, manually tune it. So the frequency here, we're going to try and tune in EWTN, the religious channel, OK? So the frequency for this is... Uh, one, one, two, six, zero. Okay, the symbol rate is twenty seven five zero zero. The LMB polarization is vertical, which is correct. It could be you could use your arrow keys to select vertical or horizontal, but it is actually um vertical. So you can see when I've typed that in there now, you can see that I have um, a good signal level and quality on that particular transponder. So it knows there's something there. And what I'm going to do is arrow to scan and uh, then use my left and right arrow to scan started. Now what this is, it's not just going to pull in EWTN, it's going to pull in everything that's actually on that particular transponder. Okay. So what I'm going to do then is I'm just going to hit the uh, exit button. And we're back to live TV. Now what I want to do here is, sorry, I've hit the wrong button there. I want to go back to the menu, go to settings, and then show non-free SAT services, okay? And I want to say yes. So at that point then, I want to hit the exit button. I want to pull up my channel list. So you can see there, there's a button called CH list on your uh, remote control. And what you want to do then is actually press the swap button on your remote control. Okay, that's in the very bottom left of your remote control. And there you go. You can see there the actual non-free SAT channels that have been added. Okay, so if I want to go to EWTN now, you can see there I'm into that. And that's basically it. How you can add and view non-free SAT channels on your Goodman or Goodman's uh, FreeSAT standard definition box.